Hello world, welcome to a new episode of... No, I'm not doing that. Um, hi. Um, yeah, it is Saturday. I did say I was going to do a vlog. I did say on the Thursday vlog, the last vlog that I did on Thursday, I did say I was going to do a vlog the next day, which was obviously Friday. But a lot of things come up. So I was busy really busy so i didn't get to do a vlog so today uh i got off work from a little bit early so you get a vlog and it'll probably be up early-ish because i don't think this vlog is going to be too long because literally it's going to be the um the zebra um city socks which i still haven't remembered the right name for them um and the triple black Japan NMDs. Yeah. So, um, as you can see, I've put my boxes of trainees behind, like stacked up. I just thought, it, as well as like all the geeky shit that I have in the backgrounds, it'll be nice to kind of have me shoe collection in boxes. I did try and take them out and obviously I bought some shelves and stuff that I put up there that I put them on and I don't know I just didn't like having them out I just didn't like having them out of the boxes on the thing because I thought I mean obviously I do try and rotate the trainers I do try and wear different trainers each day and different things but if you leave a pair on there that you haven't worn for a bit they start getting dusty and things like that and it's just no. I, I don't know, I just, I prefer the look of having them in the boxes and then obviously, literally, they've got little pictures of the shoes, so I just have to get up in the morning, go over, look at the, what picture I want, and I'm like, okay, I want them, pull them out, get them, use them, and then when I get home, put them back in the box and let them go to sleep. So yeah, that's just, that's just how it is. Um, so yeah, I, I tried, I tried having them out of the boxes and and then in the boxes like that, and I completely prefer them in the boxes like that, completely, like 100%, I, I like them in the boxes, so they're gonna stay in the boxes. And it's a nice little backdrop, you can see all the shoes, and then obviously as, as I buy more and more shoes, you go beep, 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 keep going. So yeah, um, I'll start with the triple black um, NMDs, the Japan pack, because I'm wearing them at the minute. So, there they are. That sun smash the blackness. And then I'll take you one. Um, so there's the front. There's the side. There's the back of them. There's the other side. And there's the front again. Um okay. So um I haven't worn these a lot, like literally. Um, since I got home I got a shower and things like that and then I just stuck these on because um, just to, to try them out and stuff the the um, the prime knit is really comfortable um, maybe more comfortable than most NMDs that I've had that I have um, I'm just trying to think of NMDs that I've got that are as comfortable as this um, no I don't I don't think I've got any NMDs that are actually comfortable than this. But anyway, yeah, um, I've got the the obviously the the um, the XR ones, like the first ever pair that I bought. Um, but the, but obviously they were the the first ones I ever bought, and they're comfy. Don't get me wrong, but these are a lot comfier. Like the Prime, and it just feels better. Um, I say I always I have always said um, that I'm not that fussed on like triple black shoes and like all black shoes and stuff like that. It's just the only reason I picked these up really is because they're the Japan and um, because they're part of the Japan pack and um, like the the white Japan right in there just kind of it does it for me. That's kind of the the, that was the clencher for me. That was um, or clincher, clencher. Yeah. 
um, that's that that was the that was the bottom line. Like that's what that's why I got them. Um, it's funny to say that I got a pair. Of, I've spent a lot of money on a pair of trainees just for white writing, but white Japan writing. But um, obviously, it's it's an it's an it's a comfy shoe. Like it looks sick. I mean, it looks amazing. But I always like to have me trainees kind of pop, like uh, colours and things like that. Just like, phew. but these are sick. These are super super sick. It's nice to actually have um, a pair of. Um, boost that are actually blacked out because these are the only yeah yeah I'm a hundred percent these are the only boost that I've got that I've got blacked out boost um, so yeah that's cool that's really cool um, so obviously I've got a nice nice black boost to add to the collection so and it, I mean it doesn't hurt to have different colors um, in your in your collection where like I mean I, I've got me solar red and then these um like different colors like obviously me red nikki uh nikki's now um all different all different colors of shoes but it's nice to actually have like an all black pair just in case for for if you ever go anywhere for um and you need black shoes or the style just in general you you want black shoes to go with something they're like insane to go with and the the white japan writing just pops um, I think that they look pretty much the same as as a lot of new um, NMDs that are coming out. I mean, literally, it's just they It's literally they're just all black with the Japan writing. And there's, I don't think there's anything else special about them. Um, it's literally it's an NMD. Um, it's comfortable. Don't get me wrong. I think they are. They do test the prime knits like making new prime knit and that as they're going along and they're making new shoes so maybe the prime knit's different maybe it's a it's it's a different type so it's comfortable more comfortable and more stretchy and stuff um i'm not i don't know i don't know but um it they are super comfy i mean all of them are super comfy anyway but the prime knit on this is like ridiculous it's super comfy um yeah it's i mean rubber heel tab thing on the back and then the pull tab um, the, the normal um, sole or rubber bottom whatever you want to call it um, with the sole still white underneath the boost um, they haven't blacked that out but completely black so yeah it, it, it's cool that it's like the Japan pack and it's got that on and all this kind of stuff but it's it's an NMD like it, there's nothing else big about it nothing special um, I didn't think these were going to be available I think that's kind of why I jumped on them so quick and bought them so quick because I went into seven in town which is one of the one of the main shops that I usually always go into to buy things um, buy trainees that because they get ones that are kind of more special um, not just the, the normal everyday uh, boost shoes which you see in JDs and all this kind of stuff. Um, these uh, seven quite, get quite good shoes, which I've had quite a lot um, of shoes from them. I bought my very first pair of trainees from them when it first opened. Um, and yeah, I bought loads of trainees from there because they, they do get good ones in. Um, and, and not a lot of people know about uh, know about the shop. So it, it, like, I went in, um, when did I go in now? A few days ago when I bought these. Um, and these have been out for for like a week, a week or two. And I went in and they had them in. I think it was the last size 10. This is a size 10, obviously, because I wear all my, my shoes are a 10. Um, they, I think this was the last 10 that they had. Um, so, yeah, this is cool, amazing, awesome, however you want to think. But it is just an NMD. So don't don't get twisted and think it's like some brand new, like... Thing or whatever new technology and all that stuff. No, it, it they're, a pair of, they're a pair of NMDs and they they're really comfy and the sick and the Japan Jap the Japan the Japanese writing is cool. Um, so yeah, it's a nice it's a nice little a nice little pair of trainees to add to the collection. Like I said, because it's the Japan pack, I like that more because it's kind of like a little special edition type NMD 
and I like that about I like that. That's why I've got the Henry Pools. That's why I've got the um, the Chinese New Year EQTs. That's why I've got them because they're super cool. Like they 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 like and they come in wooden boxes as well. These don't. These just come in a black box. But the the other special edition ones they come in in like proper wooden boxes, which I love. Um, and then yeah, these so um, super cool to add to the collection. They're awesome. Um, if you can get them, get them. Like, um, um, they are a pair of trainees that I did want when they first come out. It was just kind of, I'm not that, like I always say, I, I buy trainees because I like trainees and stuff. I don't buy them for the vlog or for anything else. So, I don't feel like every trainee that comes out I need to go and grab straight away and buy. Um, this was like, I seen these and I was like, yeah, I, I would like to have them. Um, I'm not, like I said, I'm not that fussed on like triple black shoes or all black shoes I'm not that fussed on them so I wasn't really like at the point where I'd go there and wait for the shop to open the day they come out um, to buy them but obviously I was in town the other day and I went into seven asked them just to see and they were there in a the size 10 so I was like do you know what I'm gonna get them J just just purely because I like them and I'm not going out of me way to buy them I mean money is money like I say I make a good bit of money. I mean, I I, I do um, work hard and and earn a good bit of money. Um, and I like to treat myself. I like trainees now. I like to feel comfortable because I spent so long when I was younger as a kid, kind of wearing trainees from my brothers and that down like that um, were handed down to me, or I had to buy off my brother because my oldest brother like used to sell me stuff like clothes and trainees and stuff. Um, and sometimes I'd buy trainees that were a little bit too small and I'd be like, oh, they're fine, they're fine, because I was getting them at a good price or something. I'd be like, yeah, yeah, they're fine, like any, any pair of trainees that I thought were nice because I buy them off my brother because I thought, oh, he's, he's got good taste. So so I'd buy them and then I'd put them on and they'd be a little bit too small or something. So when I'd go out of a day or whatever, I'd be out all day and my feet would be killing me. And, and yeah, it was just, I tried to like kind of look cooler like try and look cool first before comfort and then now I'm all about comfort but anything with boost you I mean th it, there is the odd shoe that is ugly even with boost like it's an ugly shoe but mostly anything with boost mostly they're like really good looking shoes as well so you get the comfort which is they are the most comfortable shoes I've ever wore and you get really nice looking shoes I mean they're gorgeous shoes and um, the the zebra uh, city socks that we're going to talk about in a minute they're incredibly cool looking it's just that's just that's that's what it is and i don't not a lot of people understand because they haven't tried boost on they haven't like i ask a lot of people and, and they haven't tried ultra boost on and things like that and it's like if you tried ultra ultra boost on it they would change your life and everyone laughs and if they think it's funny but Try a pair of Ultra Boost on. If you've never tried a pair of Boost or Ultra Boost, try a pair of Ultra Boost because you, because you're just denying yourself like comfort. Like honestly, buy a pair of Ultra Boost. You'll be able to wear them all day long, and your feet will be like the like you're walking on clouds. Honestly, um, so rant over. So um, triple black, Japan, NMDs. Um, super sick, and here they are on feet. So yeah, uh, they were the the triple black Japans on feet. They look cool on feet. They do. Um, obviously, I haven't um, I haven't worn them a lot um, because I've just put them on today. But they'll probably they be the next pair of trainees that I'll wear to go out and just kind of have a feel. Take them for a test drive, as I say. Um, okay, next up, 
we have got the Zebra um, City Socks. These, honest to God, like, I wore these yesterday. I went out with my dad and my brother and I wore these yesterday. Let's just give you a little, a little pew, 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 pew. Okay, um, so uh, let's just obviously the boost. Um, most obviously um, like city socks and stuff now, um, they don't have a block on the outside. They just have like the little the little cuts in the boost. You have the block on the inside. Um, and, nope, thought there was a mark on it, on it then, but it does not. Um, yeah. The, I mean, let's just talk about obviously the the normal, like obviously the the they're pretty much just city socks. Um, the the prime knit is super cool, is it's comfy. Um, yeah, I had no problems yesterday. It was they were comfy. They've got tons of boost. Um, super comfy. Literally, it doesn't feel like there's anything on your feet. I've still got the thing in it. But, um, yeah. It's just it doesn't feel like you've got anything on your feet when you when you when you wear them. Super cool. Um, I like the the sole, like the rubber sole. Um, it's kind of just like I don't know. I like it because it's kind of it's kind of see through. It's like a cloudy see through. I really like that. I like that they didn't do they didn't make it um, black or anything like that. I just I like that. I like um, that it's like a little bit different and I like it. Um, so, the main feature of this shoe, obviously, is the the, the colorway. Um, it's black with like white um, zebra stripes or zebra, I don't know, zebra, whatever you want to call it. It is called, a, I can't remember, it's like a, 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 why can I not say Japan? Japanese, why can I not say Japanese today? I keep saying Japan. Um, it's kind of got like a, um, why am I even saying Japan? Um, I had something to say about it, but, um, yeah, it's got a Japanese name, sorry. Me, I had a brain fart then, so I apologise. Um, yeah, it's, it's got like a Japanese name, I think. Um, so I don't know if these are kind of like, uh, uh, not the, ja obviously not the Japan pack, but, they kind of got like that type of vibe because um, it's called like an osh something I think but yeah the words like it sounds Japanese um, but pretty much the pretty much the, the same as like a city sock it's got like a around the bottom like going along and, and around and where does it go to that? it goes to probably about there like there and around it's kind of on the inside it's got like a like a support. It's kind of like a little bit of a wall, a little bit of an extra, extra little bit of support around it. And and you feel it, you feel your foot feels secure in the shoe. Um obviously you've still got the newer um city socks that have come out, obviously the ones before this, but um they've got the light. it's kind of like in a circle. I don't you can't really see it because of the, the white and the black in there, but they've got like the, the black lines. In there but in like a circle as well as the top part it's got like the the black lines embroidered in um, so just on the inside there and then on the front like on my brother has a pair and he's got the he's got I think they're black and they're, they've got like pink um, stripes well obviously these you can't really see them unless you look up close but they've got they have got them the embroidered lines you should be able to see them. I think you can see them. Um, but yeah, the colour. The, the thing about this, like obviously the colour looks nice when you look at it from like there. It looks nice. But the best viewpoint is when you look down. Like, it's, it, they remind me of um, the kind of the ones that... Um, what, are they, what are they now? I can't think of them. They're like the hippie ones. They're red. They're like hippie, red hippie... Um, I, honestly, I can't. I can't think of them. But um, when you look at them from above, like honestly, um, let, me, let me just let me put that back in so you can get a better view. Honestly, when you that's like what you see when you when you walk and and 
I think that's the best view. That's like honestly, like people can look at it from the sides and the front and all this kind of stuff. You're getting the best seat in the house because you're looking down at them and they are just super. It's like a. It reminds me of like, of like a like sonar, like literally like like that's like sonar to me. Like it reminds me of when like it's the actual screen with the sonar on and then it's going beep bleep around the thing. That reminds me of it. So maybe the, the, I can I'll start calling them the sonars. Ooh, not like solar red or anything like that. The sonars, sonars. Um, it probably won't catch up. But these are, I think, might be like, I know I said um, me parlays are my favourites. The rare, the, the rare, like, parlays are like up there, like I love them, like they are like close to like amazing. Um, but these have kind of, they're up there, they're like... I'd either say the second, my second favourite, or the joint first, because, and that's literally just going off, like, I love City Socks, like, I love City Socks, I love the style where it's, like, the kind of burrito look, I love that, I love just the, the kind of, the outside of it, it's quite, it's quite clean, there's no, there's no, um there's no brick on the outside and it's just it, it just looks like a clean shoe nice neat but then the color hits it as well and then this colorway is just to me as soon as i put these on as soon as i put these on it was it was that was it we were done it, we were over it was it was game over my credit card was coming out it was getting banged right onto it um so I got these and these at the same time. I actually, like I said in the last video, which which shoe was it now? I wore them. I put them on like that. I put that the right one on of that and the left one on of that. I put them both on and I was like, I had to get both of them. I was just like, yeah, I'll have both of them. Uh, especially more so this one. Like I, I put these on and I just had like, there's just I know when not to buy things and when to buy things and when you'll you might try shoes on or you might try clothes on clothes on and they just don't fit right or feel right or look right and you just there's something in your brain that's kind of nagging at you and it's like yeah I do want to get it but then there's something in your brain that's like you don't yeah I know like I have that a lot but with shoes like this honestly as soon as I put it on and looked down and then looked in like the little weird mirrors that they have for your shoes, it was game over. It, like that was, it was coming home with me and that was, that's the end of it. And it's cool as well because obviously these were, uh, we went um, the other day when these were, um, it was the day these come out. So um, I didn't see these, the City Sock ones in anywhere else but seven. Um, and yeah, I just got it, got them straight away because I thought I don't know how long they're gonna stay um, in the shop. Like because I thought these, I mean the way I'm, I'm like fanboying out over them. I can only imagine what people are gonna be like with them. Um, and then obviously they've got the the um, the R twos, are they? R twos. Like there's a pack. There's this one, and then there's two pairs of. I think there are twos, um, and ones like that, like that colorway where it's like black with white on, and then the other one is white with black on. I like this colorway on the R twos though. Um, I really like them. So obviously they, they kind of look like that in that style. Yeah, they are like the the NMDs. Um, I think they are anyway. I'm probably wrong because I'm wrong most times um, but hey who cares probably a lot of people but yeah um super amazing sick like these honestly are one of my favorites now I'm probably gonna look at getting the this colorway in the R2s 
I think. <laughs> but these ones in the other shoe, um, because they're super sick. And I've seen them ones in a lot of places. Like I've seen them, a lot of shops up must have ordered them in. Um, so I don't know. I don't know what the stock level is like with that type of shoe but I'm happy that I've got these if I went into a shop and I couldn't get the other ones I wouldn't be that bothered because I've got these and these are like the the one the, the nicest ones let's be honest these are the nicest ones of that pack 100% 100 million percent um, so yeah that's the zebra city sock I know it's a J Japanese name but I can't remember it so um, yeah, here's the uh, on feats for that. So, there, that was the, um, the Zebra City Socks. They look sick on feet, like, like, possibly one of the best that I think look on feet. Like, I know obviously I said they're like kind of one of my favorites. They're kind of either second or joint with the Parleys, um, but on feet, they look the nicest. Like, they, I think they look the nicest. 100%, that's just my, my, my opinion, but, I think they especially just it's just that color it's just that the um the the, the what you call it the pattern and stuff um the colorway and the pattern um I just there's just something about it I just I, yeah there's just something about it um amazing on feet like I think the I mean obviously you've just seen the on feet so you can judge if you like them or not or if they are you think they look the nicest but 100% I think that's my opinion they look the best on feet 100% um, so yeah that was pre that's pretty much it um, for today literally I just wanted to show you them two in another video because I didn't want to make a video that was too long um, I know I do make long videos like but um, like I had the Anikis and then I was talking about the Henry Pools and all this kind of stuff and it was just like I just didn't want it to go on more and more and then talk about other shoes and then more on feet and, the, and, and and then obviously I'm trying to make more videos and I kind of have more um, more content more videos so obviously it builds me me profile a bit more and um, I mean I could have done all the shoes in separate videos but um, I'm, I'm pretty lazy um, so well I, I wouldn't say I'm lazy I'm busy I'm, I'm busy I just yeah I, I, I say I'm lazy but I'm busy I'm like I, I do have things to do and I do have a life that I live um, I know I should really because it's a vlog I should really vlog a bit more and when I'm going places and stuff but it's hard taking a big camera to, to things and and you have an idea of, of how it's going to be when you make a vlog. When, when you start a vlog and you think, okay, well, I've, I've done this vlog, so I'm going to take this camera out and I'm going to film every part of my day. It doesn't turn out like that. And, and kind of, when you think about taking cameras to places, you've got to think, you've got to be like, well, where am I going today? Or where can I, where, where, where might I end up? And then you think, well, if I'm taking this camera, it's going to be a bit thing. And then you have a look at the weather and if it's lashing down, especially England, because it rains a lot, especially now. It's supposed to be summer, but it rains a lot. See, it's gone sunny again. Before, it was, it was raining, it was lashing down. Um, so, yeah, you've got to kind of see the weather, because obviously I don't want to take my camera out. And then it's that lashing down, and it's like, oh, I've got my camera and it's lashing down. So, yeah. Um, so, it's kind of, it is a bit, it is hard. It's a lot hard, harder than people think it is. Um, but I'm trying. I'm going to try and do more. I'm going to try and vlog more and take the camera out more. But let's just see how it goes. I'm just literally winging it. I've been winging it from the very beginning. I'm still winging it now. Uh, yeah. So, yeah. Um, so that's it. Japan pack. Zebra pack. 
done for you guys on feet. I hope you're all having a good Saturday. I keep I always say this every weekend when I do a vlog. Try not to get too drunk when you go out tonight. Be careful and be safe. And yeah, as always guys, thanks for watching.